sit down in the tutorial on how to get series in this tutorial i will be going to show you how to create a dead block okay for example you can prepare a drawing of a residential or short residential or commercial building in that you can find there is a lots of door like a 50 60 or 100 door so you can don't need to create a 50 or 60 doors you can simply create a one door block and simply put it so our work is very simple to do okay uh, in this i already made a door block okay so i will show you how how it can work now you simply click on it so you can see a different arrows and point here uh, from these two little arrows you can simply flip it in two directions okay so you can flip it on all four direction uh, by these two arrows this one and this one you can simply scale it by scale down and scale up okay and for this point you can simply rotate it by 360 turn okay so now i am going to show you how to create this door block okay so first of all we are going to create a simple right angle of a okay so first click and give a dimension of 1.2 and at right angle also give a 1.2 okay now simply press escape to exit the command now what we are going to do uh, create a polyline but first of all you need to understand what why we should draw this this is the reference line this is not needed but for the reference purpose we have created it so go to polyline and uh, what going to do simply simply go here and uh, and at the point 0 4 meter 4 distance you can click your first point now what going to what we are doing going uh, create a line up to bottom here okay so parallel to this you can simply click here here and simply you can make a door okay now door is prepared now we are create a arc for the opening so simply go here and click on arc now simply you can put it here and click okay click and press escape to exit command now we are going to do delete this reference line so click on it and press delete key on the keyboard now our uh, door and opening side is ready so we are going to create a blog of it so simply press on b for blog sorry block and press enter now we are name it a door okay now pick a point so now I am pick a point here and now select the object click on it and simply select the object and right click now you can see here little preview here so our door is selected now you can check this is clicked or not if it is not clicked you will click on it and simply click on ok now you can see here our block editor is open now what we are going to do now first of all we are give it the flipping property okay so first of all we are going to parameters and in parameters you can find the flip okay so click on flip now you can click at the point first point here and the second point here and after that you can put the flip state 1 at middle now you can see here the arrow uh, it means uh, our first flip property is uh, assigned it now again we are going to do a flip property of it now simply click here and end it uh, like here okay and put it at the middle here 
now our flip both flip properties are assigned it so now we are going to give it a action for action we are going to click on flip uh, now it's ask for parameter so click on flip state one and now it's ask for the select object so select the uh, door object and simply right click now you can see here this flip flip icon is shown now it means that now our flip property is assigned with the flip state one now we can do this same thing with the flip state two so click on flip now you can go to flip state two select object right click now you can see here only one but if you move this so you can find another one so now you can see our flip property is assigned now what we want what we are going to do uh, we are going to move this arrow sorry not only arrow not flip property so click on arrow move it to a, like a uh, here sorry you can move only and only arrow okay you don't need to move uh, the state only arrow move move your arrow okay at the middle now what we are going to do we are going to give it a scale property so we are click on the linear and again select uh, this end point to here and distance one at here okay now we are going to action and give the scale property so click on scale so select the parameter distance one and select the object uh, door and right click now you can see the scale property is assigned now again we are going to parameters and now we are going to give it a rotation property so now click on rotation select first point second point and now we are going to select arc okay so now angle one okay so now we are going to give it a action simply go to action click on rotate now select a parameter of angle and now click on the this uh, our object and simply right click simply right click now you can see here our rotation parameter is assigned okay so now our uh, block is ready to use now what we are going to do we are close the editor and it's ask for save the changes of two door simply click on yes now you can see this is our first previously i already made now this door is we are recently made so now simply click on it now you can see all the parameters which are applied it, it can works okay so simply you can flip scale okay and rotate rotate by 360 degree okay for now this tutorial uh, finish here i can finish this tutorial here uh, hope you guys this, you are enjoyed it hope you this information is help in for your drawing see you in the next tutorial please like share and comment on this video and do not subscribe do not forget to subscribe my channel for more videos okay see you next time